Valentine's week is around the corner. I don't really believe in it, but I can help you guys with something. So let's get into the video. Basically, some of my friends call me love guru. Some of them say that I'm a good con counselor. And a lot of people share their stories with me to, to seek any advices that I, they want from me. And I feel that I am pretty good from as being a normal person. I think I'm pretty good in this field. And I'm going to start up a page called Secret Cupid to do all this kind of stuff because I love doing all this kind of stuff. And, and later on it changed to something else. That's, that's another story. So I wanted to start a series over here to help you guys with some kind of tips or something. It can be related to anything. So basically, let me tell you guys, love is not only between a girl and a boy. It's between mother and father. It's between mother and daughters, father and son, mother, son, daughter and father, grandparents, in between grandparents and granddaughters, friends, siblings, everyone. So let's celebrate this Valentine's week with the people we love. It's it's not mandatory that it should be with a book girl and a boy. It can be with anyone. So today I'm going to take only a small topic which is called gifts. Because when someone says Valentine's Day, all I can think is about gifts. Talking about gifts, there are two ways. One is the traditional way which is basically a lot of ve like very basic it is. So in traditional ways, we have two things again. One is the roses. We can never go wrong with roses. It's like a girl's best friend. But then it's not unisex so you can't really give it a person a, a boy a who cares like, I don't I don't think so it's like a good best friend for a boy and the second gift is traditional gift is chocolate so chocolate goes with everyone it's a unisex you can give it to anyone you can give it to your grandparents your sibling your friend anyone but I say why do we only have to choose these like these are the gifts for Valentine's week or something else. Why only these roses and chocolates or if it's a teddy day, it's a teddy bear. Why? Okay, if you say that it's a rose day, then you may have to give a rose. Okay, I don't really believe. If you guys believe it, just do it. I'm talking about gifts which are for Valentine's Day. So for that, I'm gonna help you guys with some kind of gift tips and tricks in here. There are no tricks, basically they're only tips. So why do we choose these kind of gifts? You can rather go for something that he or she needed, like she wanted. If you know them for a bit, like a couple of months or something, that you should know that what they really like and what they want at that time of, at that moment. So you can get them that. Or else you can get something functional, which, or not functional, which can stay forever. If it's not forever, but creates a memory with them. So I say instead of gifting them roses, you can get them something they need. And this way you can actually save roses. I mean that, why do you want to pick a rose which is for a satisfaction of one or two hours? You're basically killing it. Once you pluck it, it's like, it's, it is dying. Let it die naturally. So, uh, I don't know, I'm not talking about, it, you know, save nature and stuff, but yeah. It's basic that die, let it die naturally than just plucking it up and making it die so soon. And secondly, you'll not cause yourself eating a lot of chocolate. So basically when I was a kid, I used to eat a lot of chocolates. Basically I used to eat like 5 to 6 huge bars a day and I had some appetite problem at that time and my doctor said that I have been eating a lot of chocolates and the chocolate got stuck completely like a paste in my tummy and that created some appetite issues. I know it's like very stupid to believe to it, believe to it, but then you know you don't really need to take chances. So yeah, I say no chocolates as well. Oh yeah, you can give chocolates like once, twice, thrice. Don't eat a lot of chocolates because Valentine's Day I see a lot of people getting you know huge boxes of chocolates and people go crazy about it. You might put yourself into trouble with that. So, so the gift ideas I would suggest you are one is a fish ball that creates memories as well as I know the fish is not going to stay forever, but then that is going to create a memory. Whenever she or he sees that, or your parents or someone else, whoever it is, the partner, they see that they actually think about you. That this has 
to be given by someone. So I think that is a great idea. And also, you need to check about it. Uh, why don't you just go and talk to them? Like ask them, just take them around to a shopping or something. Ask them what they what they like. If they like, they say that I really like this sweat. You just say it's not that great at that time. Just go alone and just get that. This way, they get surprised a lot. And maybe if it is related to your family or like mom and dad or someone, they might be asking you or not asking you. They don't really ask kids, but then they they might be saying that you know. I wanted this for so long. It it may be a kitchen item. It can be anything. They might be saying that I wanted this for a long time. So find out that one thing they wanted and then get them, get them that. So this Valentine's Day, I hope we can celebrate it with our parents and also whomever we love. It's not only about a girl and a boy. I don't think so. It's just between a girl and a boy. So let's celebrate this Valentine's Day green. Let's not hurt anything, even not even flowers. I say. Well, that's it for the video, guys. I hope you like it. If you did, give me a big thumbs up and also comment below if you have any video suggestions. And also, you can get in touch with me on my social media somewhere over here. I'll just gonna put it over here, maybe. So you can get in touch with my social media and if you want any kind of a suggest, my doors are always open. I can give you suggestions. You can put, you can directly put the command over here or you want to mail, you can mail it to my email ID or you can also direct message me on my Facebook or Instagram page. It's anonymous guys. I'm not gonna read your name and it's going to be like, if you want advice like without a video, I can also do that. I don't know, I, I just really want to help with whatever I'm good at because I've done a lot like this to people and people said that I'm really good at it and I'm a good listener as well so yeah I can hear your problems and I know right I really feel sometimes that someone should be there to hear my problems and they just hear it and keep it with them they're not even telling anyone so yeah I am that kind of a person I'm looking for I wanted someone like me so that's it for the video guys I hope you like it and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this and I'll see you guys in my next video until then we have loads of love happy Valentine's